M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So, we're looking at the Yaesu SCU cables that you could use for PDN mode ETC. And right now, just for these, this video, we're going to look at the FT5 and the FT400. So, if you've got Windows 10 or before, then the standard cables that you've been using work fine. So, things like the SCU19, the SCU20, the SCU39 kit and the SCU40, but if you're using Windows 11, uh, Yaesu have had to make new cables because Microsoft do not support the older use of USB cables in Windows 11. So now when you go to your file section here and scroll to the bottom, you now get this new selection, X Connection Cable Kit Driver Installation Manual. So they really want you to read that manual. They don't just let you just click and download the software now. You, they really want you. So let's have a look at one of them. So if you look here, they, they have, you know, you can see they've put a lot of work into this. They're really trying to explain what's what. And they've listed the cables here, SCU 57, 58, and then you've got the old numbers there of 39 40 now if you scroll a bit lower you'll see that they once you've downloaded this manual they have put it here for you so look scu 39 scu 40 and they've ticked where it says windows 10 windows 8.1 but windows 11 you have to get an scu 57 and an scu 58 now i think this is really important that you know this um so download these manuals read them it's also very handy because it's it's showing you um how to do it hopefully there's a link on here for the actual for the download um what i'll do is i'll find the link and then i'll put it in the description because i'm seeing the instructions i can't see the actual download for the driver that you would need Anyway, so let's now look at the FTM 400 again. You go to files, go all the way to the bottom. Here it is here, cable kit driver. Now, is this the driver here? The PL23XX prolific driver. Let's just click it. Uh, hopefully it actually is. And then we'll look at the other one as well. Yesu, go to the bottom. Uh, y is X driver. Here is PL23X driver. I won't do them both. As you know, all links will be in the description. So I think it's quite an important thing to know, you know, if your PDN just suddenly stops working because your computer is automatically upgraded to Windows 11, then you're going to need to either buy a cable or revert it back to Windows 10, which I think is a bit of a pain in the neck and at the least that Yesu could have done. Um, I know it's not completely their fault, is at least released these cables, maybe for the first, I don't know, year at a lower sort of price because we've been forced to use different cables but anyway that's my take on it and i'm sure john crook will love me for saying that so anyway seven free thanks very much and catch you on air links in description all the best